Well, there was a fantastic crowd at Mullingar Greyhound Stadium last Saturday night to witness the final of the 2012 Game Feeds Irish Cesarevich. It was great to see all the families out having a great fun night at the Dogs and the action didn't let them down. There were a number of big finals on the night culminating in the big classic Game Feeds Irish Cesarevich. Let's go and look at the runners. Trap one, we have Subway Ruth for Alan Dunn Malahide and trained by Francie Murray in Crookedwood. This one's only having her 10th career start and she's actually a daughter of a former winner of the event in Forest Baby. This one by Hondo Black. In trap two, we have the finisher in the pack, Incitatious, won by Javier Jorn in Spain and trained by Pat Buckley. Uh, this one's a winner of five from 21. Can it turn close? Because if it does, it could swoop late. In trap three, we've the fast starter, Smart Fantasy, won by Helen Whelan and Leash, the winner of five from ten, this lightly raced daughter of Premier Fantasy in Glen Four. She's got a nice bit of boot to the turn and she ran very well in the semi-final. In trap four, we have Barefoot Machine, the Kilkenny Raider, for Brian Murphy and Kathleen Murphy. This one's trained by Paul Hennessy, a winner of five from 28. Showed great battling qualities when winning its semi-final. In five, we have a likely leader in Crossfield Star, won by Brendan O'Shea in Mill Street. This one really can blaze a trail. It's won six from 18, a son of Droopy Scolari and Vieri, sure thing. And in trap six, we have the hot favourite, Dynamic Trend, won by Helen Whelan in Leash. This one's a kennel mate of trap three. It's a daughter of Droopy Scolari in Woodhill Spark, a winner of six from 11, and won in a flashy 33-15 in its semi-final. It's a cracking lineup. They're heading to traps for the final of the 2012 Game Feeds Irish Zarevich. The hair on the spin for the final of the Game Feeds Irish Zarevich from the rail out Subway Ruth, Incitatious, Smart Fantasy, Barefoot Machine, Crossfield Star, and Dynamic Trend. Here's the bunny, and away they go, and one Subway route away well on the inside, on the outside, a little bit of Argy Barge between five and six, Crossfield Star and Dynamic Trend, the one dog Subway route has the advantage at the first couple of corners, four barefoot machine, Harry's on the outside, now half a length down, it's one, four, three, five, and six, and the two dog trails him, clearing on the bunny, Subway route leads at the car park, turn by a length, cuts the nose off the four dog, and runs a beautiful final, final corner, and opens up by four or five lengths, Subway Ruth, a daughter of a former winner, Forrest Baby, pulled clear for a fantastic win in the Cesarevich, the champ for 2012. Subway Ruth in a time of blistering 33.07. Well, what a fantastic race that was. The result, first number one, Subway Ruth, owned by Alan Dunn and Malahide and trained by Francie Murray. Second, number four, Barefoot Machine. And third, number six, Dynamic Trend. The time, a rocket fast, 33.07. Big stakes here, your local track. And uh, that's two in only four short years. Yes, thanks very much. But, um, ah, sure, look, you have the dog, you can win, like, you know. You have to have the article first. Yeah, she was fantastic tonight. We, we did fancy her tonight. Um, the one box was perfect for her. Uh, she came away extremely well, uh, ran very strong. I was worried at the third bend. I think she went outside. Um, I thought she'd lost at that stage, but her finish was unbelievable. She really finished strong. And I just can't believe I won it again. Definitely the Oaks is on the cards. Before that, I don't know. So, yeah, definitely. Yeah, it worked out very, very well, and it's nice to see history repeating itself. Great open final as well, and uh, it was a great open stake. Like uh, earlier on in, in the, the stake, we were talking about different dogs completely to the final, with a top class final. That's one of the reasons we come here, as I say, every year there. You know, they, they come for the four corners with, with, like, with the runners from Cork, like Kenny, um, a bit from the north as well. But uh, very, very good, and, and a winner that didn't go uh, unfancied from the start. I believe connections are on at double figures, and tonight she went off at a very fancy three to one. I told a few lads here, don't don't be slow here with the box and all, but uh, not not slow the connections here. The target is fair play. Everything went well for them on the night, and they couldn't say anything better than that for them. You know?